How's it going everybody? It's been a while since I talked to you guys. I am still out here in the Arizona desert out of Pilot Knob LTVA. Been stuck here for a long time and <laughs> yeah it's getting boring. Getting a little bit lonely. I'm kind of over the lonely stage. It After three or four months it's just you get used to it. You really do. Let's go outside. So this is my backyard. You get to hear that interstate noise quite a bit because this right here is facing north. This is northeast and that is generally the direction the wind comes out of. Showing my neighbors I got. This place is packed you guys. This place is absolutely packed. There's Pilot Knob right up there. I need to climb that again. But yeah, there's my newest neighbor right over there. He's from Canada. He's in his kind of a bus tank. And then, well, that's actually the new newest neighbor right there. So far, they got solar. I think everybody's pretty cool out here. I don't want to get you out in the sun because it's going to be blinding. But yeah, this place is literally freaking packed. Let me go up on top of the RV and show you. There's my solar setup right there. It's uh, four 100 watt panels. I did get one more new panel and it helped quite a bit. It's a little breezy, so there's probably gonna be some wind noise. And I've got them all in series. See, that's pretty bright, but you can see, I mean, you can't really see. I could zoom it maybe. Off in the distance, there is a lot of people out here. It's the fullest I've ever seen this place. And there's the camp host spot up there. Yeah, I'm at the old camp host spot. So if you want to come out and say hello, um, I'm here. Usually I'm here. If my car is here, I'm here. If my car is not here, I do have neighbors that keep an eye on the place for me. So. If there's any thieves or anybody out there watching, don't do it. I got cameras too. That's the newest panel right there. I ordered that online. Got that from Home Depot. I am ready to get the hell out of this place, guys, but I can't. I gotta wait till at least March before I can even think about rolling a tire. I could go up north. I could go to Blythe. I could go to Lake Havasu. I really, I, I really should. I want to stay here because I can go to town and brush up on my tennis and, and keep consistent with that, but I really should. I really should head somewhere else, up towards Vegas or something. But the other thing that sucks about that is the way I, the way I go home, I don't like going over any mountains, pulling this car, because I don't have any brakes hooked up to my car. I mean, my car has brakes. You know what I mean. I, I The sole brakes are the RV. There's no help from the car. So uh, mountains are a little scary for me. Even though I drive really slow. If you know me, watch my videos, you know I do 50 miles an hour on the interstate. No matter where I am, I do 50 miles an hour because I'm trying to get at least 10 miles to the gallon. Well, that's all I get. It's never any better unless I got it huge tailwind but yeah this is a nice little spot i got my own fire ring i barely ever use it i've got a picnic table i do do push-ups off the edge of that picnic table they're not full flat push-ups but then i have that rope and some rocks so i can do some exercises that's it i'm going to try and upload some more videos just to give you guys something boring to watch <laughs> i don't know i gotta do something to stay busy Want to say hi, Kip? Kip's got this issue where his back will itch. He gets the itchies on his back. I think there's a name for it. And it just drives him nuts. He tries licking and stuff like that. Feel bad for the poor guy. What do you think, Kip? I'm sure he's ready to leave, too. I want to do some van travels, Kip. I think we should go to Bitcoin City, see his back. I shouldn't even touch it. I can't pet him, I absolutely can't pet him. I can give him some back rubs and he's, that seems to help a little bit, but if I just hold my hand on it, it, it helps. You can tell it soothes him quite a bit. Poor guy, has to put up with those twitches. There he goes. 
He's getting the twitches. See, this stuff is disgusting, guys. I tried some of this. I, I'm just gonna throw it away. I've been trying, to, I hate to waste anything, but it's so sweet. Do not ever get that. It's so sweet, it's disgusting. I'm not much of a drinker anyways, but ugh. It gets boring out here. It's hard not to drink. Look at this mess. Look at that rat's nest. I'm in the middle of cleaning this RV. It's a total disaster. I was going through all my electrical box or whatever to get my camera and find where everything is because I'm going to try and make videos again. I'm just going to do quick camera videos, I think. Kip loves that little spot back there. Look at him. Oh, look, there he is. His hideout. I'll, I'll see you guys in the next video. I'll try and put something up that's kind of cool or whatever. I don't know. Maybe you just like to listen to me talk. <laughs> Fall asleep to my voice. All right. I'll see you guys later. Peace.